Hey guys, the Bamdo here, and welcome to another character dress-up video. In today's episode, we're going to be going over Peter Quill, or Star-Lord from Guardians of the Galaxy, for the new movie Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 2, which is coming out, I think, May, something like that. I I'm not completely sure. But, yeah, so let's get right into the video. Alright, to start off the video, we're going to be going over how to make yourself look like, I guess, kind of Chris Pratt. This isn't going to be really in detail, I'm just doing hair, but, like, you might as well do it. So, to start off, we're going to go to hairstyles and we're going to find the short brushed which is number number 11 and then we're going to change the color to 5 it looks like a nice dark brown quick select gorgeous uh, and his hair is a bit messy too because like he's he's been doing stuff and this is kind of a bit messy too so like you can kind of see some hair sticking up so that's that's good then we're going to go to beards, and then we're going to go down to, uh, where's it? Stubble. That's just what it's called? Yeah, stubble, okay. And then also, uh, we color five. And we're click, accept. And that is, uh, that's everything. So yeah. On to, on to the next part of the video. Okay, to start out with the outfit, what we're going to do is we're going to go to biker jackets. And then we're going to choose out the Ox Blood Bluesen jacket. I passed it. Oops, it is. Here it is. It's kind of a reddish brown, and it has like padding on it. It's a lot like his jacket. I'll have a picture. I guess you, yeah, you notice that. Next, what we're gonna do is we're going to go to T-shirts. I have a checklist. T-shirts, which is I guess number seventeen, and then we're going to find the ashy V-neck. <laughs> Sounds like something I want to wear. <laughs> and it's kind of like, it's not exactly what he has in the movie, but you can't be perfect. He kind of has like a sweaterish thing. It looks, it looks a bit more thick than what I'm wearing here, but it's, it's the closest thing that'll work in GTA. So after that, we're going to come over here to pants. And we are going to go down to leather pants, and we're going to use the chalk, no, that's black padded. Here it is. Uh, they also they're kind of padded, so it kind of looks like it's armored-ish. Uh, it's, it's the closest thing that you can get to it. Next, we're going to move ourselves over to boots. Pick out some nice shoes right here. For our shoes, we're going to, go to boots, and then we're going to go all the way. Or I guess shoot. We're going to go down to chocolate lace of boots, which are number thirteen. Now, his in the movie, I'm. I'm pretty sure they might be like a darker. Oh no, they are brown, but it's yeah, it's definitely a darker brown. Uh, this is just the best thing that fits. I look like a cowboy so far. Next, we're going to go over to the accessories and choose out gloves, and we're going to choose the brown leather gloves right here. Now it kind of looks weird with the jacket, but that's just what he has in the movie. Like, you, there are some black highlights, but you can't use the black combat gloves for some reason. It just, it's GTA's weird logic. But yeah, that'll be it with the regular outfit. And we're going to get on to some more accessories now. Alright guys, we're back. And one of the biggest parts of Star-Lord is his mask. It has red glowing eyes and kind of a metallic look. And we can't really get red glowing eyes. You could use contacts, but that just won't look the same. So I decided to only go to... In mask, you go to intimidation and then choose the metal warrior. It kind of gives that, I guess, worn look, and it's just probably the closest thing to it. Now it does look kind of scary and not like his mask, but it's the closest thing you're gonna get to it. They do have other masks that have red eyes, like, but obviously you can't. They're usually Halloween themed masks, and I don't think you can get them here, or at like, any time. So, yeah, this this is the closest thing to it. So I'll see you in the next clip. Alright, the last part of Star Lord that it's not necessary, but you kinda wanna have it, like it's it's up to you really, is usually he has like a bag or a satchel, and there's a way to get a duffel bag, there's a glitch. It's really confusing to get, and I'm not sure. I, I just I'd look it up if I were you if you're gonna do that. But the next best thing you can do is go buy a parachute and then use the black combat bag or charcoal bag, either of those work. Or maybe even never mind, yeah. Those two are probably the best. They're probably like the most like a backpack. If you 
put it on to make it okay to have it equipped you go to style parachute and then just turn it on and it looks like he's kind of wearing a harness which is kind of cool too like it just adds detail to it and there you go it's like a backpack all right guys that is it for the star lord costume tutorial if you enjoyed the video don't forget to like comment and subscribe uh share with your friends Yeah, I